ba 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 Doing ranked games, hopefully. Hello, all. I would like to support, please. Support is my best role. I'm not going to attempt it. Usually, when you ask for support, they will give it to you. Uh, it's that and, and jungle and uh, occasionally mid right now. Feels like no one takes mid anymore. Usually mid was like the first thing called. Now everybody wants top and AD carry. Everybody used to be mid. But uh, support and jungle are like the two roles that nobody wants to do anymore. Occasionally you get the odd jungler it's like, oh, I want a jungle. But support is easily the number one role that nobody wants to. Followed by jungle. And we have the six most common bands right here for the win. Oi, vey. Sorry, bro, I'm going to top. Flat tone. You know. Oh, you know what? What ADC will you go Go Ash or Press. Feel the thorns embrace. I sincerely doubt that that Soraka is mid Soraka, and even if it is, just about anybody you go in the mid lane will crush Soraka. Because she's going to level up her wave clear ability first, which is her Q, and then her heal, set, or, uh, her heal last, if it's mid Soraka, then her silence. And the silence does damage on hit. As well as Silence of Fear. Okay, so good. We got Ash there. And nobody's in Venn right now. Well, I mean, the people in Venn, but I'm in the channel, so hopefully they won't bother me. But Zyra Ash, uh, a lot of Korea teams use it right now. Uh, Korean, sorry, Korea, Korean teams. Cloud9 on the North American team. They are famous for Ash Zyra bot. It's such a good combination of champions. It really is. I mean, you don't really think about it, but I think it's it just it's one of those teams that just kind of works, and you know you don't you know why, but you're like you wonder why nobody thought of that before, or you think about it if you've never seen it, and you're like, how would that work exactly? <clears throat> yeah, okay, so Soraka was support, 
That was pretty easy to follow. Now, I'm really more concerned about the mid lane. They have no stealthers on their team, by the way, so I don't need to pick up any visions early. I can, but I won't, because there's, there's no point. There's no reason to. Um, but Morgana is what concerns me the most. Like, Morgana against Kha'Zix is kind of one of those matchups that could go either way. You know, Kha'Zix is all physical, so Morgana is probably going to pick up a really early Zhonya's. Like, she probably want to go for that first, I'm guessing. If it's a, a good Morgana. That way she'll be able to last longer against Kha'Zix. And when she has her ult at level 6. You know probably around. Maybe if she, if she gets fed early. Maybe around level 9 or 10. She'll be able to build the Zhonya's. She'll be able to use the, the ult Zhonya combo. Which is ridiculously annoying. And just give Kha'Zix such a hard time. Oh wow that was a quick load screen. That was quick. Welcome to Summoner's Rift. Alright, let's see. Come closer. They actually have a pretty strong level 1, so invading probably isn't the best idea. I mean, we have a good one too, but they have... They have Morgana Snare, Soraka Silence. Zack is going to pick up... Uh, his, his, uh, just a exploding, I don't know, what it's his W, which just does damage because he's jungling. Tristana is really heavy with, um, damage early on, because she has that dot. She picks that up. And York's so ghouls are just unstoppably difficult, so... Off the beaten path. Zyra, you the best. We need some music or something Such going a on busy in the background. World. Just to make these videos a little bit better. I think I could do something like that. I'll just sit here for a bit. Oh, oh, I better help all there. What lurks beneath the soil? You know what is ridiculously amazing right now is Folly Bear Jungle. People underestimate that so much, but it's so good. It's so strong. Mainly because of that Folly Bear passive early. Okay, now Tristana is such an annoying piece of crap. Hate her so much. And it's good I didn't pick Leona because Leona is one of the few champions that does not stop Tristana's uh, jump away with her Zenith Blade. So I don't usually pick Leona Waiting against Tristana. Does she have her? She, okay, she's already used up. She doesn't. What? Did she? No, she didn't even get bonus for it. So, what does this Soraka have? She's got some ability power, three ability power, and then she picked up mana. Um, what the hell is this called? A fairy charm and a, and a rejuve po or a reju bead. Which is a little strange, but. Things aren't always what they seem. Oh, that hurts. Pain. Such a busy Morning, my AD carry. I'm going to ward, so I don't do anything stupid. You know what, I'm going to use Help Pot real quick, because I don't Come closer. trust anybody. And Soraka's already used up all of her wars, and she's still level 1. Now she's level 2. That's Zack. And that 
was a fail. Zack slingshot. So much more to see. Wait until my seeds take root. Venture. Okay, now Tristana is really low, so she won't go for anything kill-based unless she knows she can get it. So if there's some a minion low, what I'm going to want to do is basically cock block her from standing anywhere close to the minion, because she knows she's going to basically die if she gets anywhere close. So. Let's just use my little thing here. Okay. Take careful steps. No, 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 Ash, no. Careful. Use a health pot. There we go. Come closer. Just a harmless flower. Okay, now I'm in a slight jam here because Tristana wants to push this lane because she knows that we're going back. So I'm just gonna lay some seeds here. Many surprises. So that way the turret can take damage. Prevent her from leaving. Death is in bloom. Oh, come on, Volley. Get her. Get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. Come on. Come on, one more hit. No. Wait until my seeds take root. See, that's what I was concerned about. I'm not really sure where Kha'Zix died, but that's what I was concerned about, and I'm, I'm guessing that Zack had to do something with it. Things aren't always what they seem. Why does Morgana have two kills? Who did she kill? Such a busy world. She picked up the F sword. Take of course careful she did. steps. An enemy has been slain. Venture off the beaten path. Oh, I 
have that warded. Be careful. Bears pass, we got activated. Such a it's not the worst map. case scenario, but could have had better. Oh no! Oh, wow! Burned a flash. That's funny. So much more. Oh, nice. Go, Kha'Zix. Let's try and push this lane a bit. Rock I have now. It's got one vision and three regulars. Just a so I'm actually not going to go back. Usually I go back, but I want to get to six first because the Sorak is already out leveling me by just over a level. An enemy has been there we go. An Such a busy that way design. I have that when she's coming to get me. Now, Soraka is probably going to break that vision. That's what I thought. Now, the biggest problem with this is, and I still do it sometimes, but I really need to get out of the habit, is to always have two visions on you. One to break uh, their vision, uh, and the other for whatever you need it for, you know? You always want to break their vision ward with your own vision ward. You have to do that. You know, if they have two, you need to carry three. You need to carry one extra to break their vision or else you're going to lose vision control and open yourself up to a lot of more ganks. It's just something that I learned. Uh, be careful, Ash, for one minute please, just so I can break this. There we go. One, two, and three. A promising now, the team they have is not a dive team. Come on, Zyra, what are you doing? The team they have is not a dive team. So they will not turret dive, even if they're pushing a lot. Like, even if they have a full minion wave, they won't do it. Because Ash can slow them, and the turret will just focus on them, and then Ash will probably end up with at least one kill. Maybe end up uh, not trading, but something. Shut down. So we ended up trading 80 carries, and I am I would not be able to take Soraka. You know, I, she she I don't know what she's leveling up. I would assume it's the silence first, maybe the heal, depending on uh, the way this person plays. But at this low level, I wouldn't be able to take her because she would just be able to cue me down, silence me, keep me from casting. It just and I'm already lower health. So it wouldn't work out. 
Wait until my seeds take root. Careful steps. This is still warded, this area, if I'm correct. The forest holds many surprises. Things aren't always what they seem. Oh, come on. Such a busy world. Well, Kha'Zix did signal, so... Can't get mad at him yet. My friend thinks it's so clever. Your team has destroyed a turret. Your turret has been destroyed. Venture off the beaten path. That won't kill me. Will I be able to recall it yet? Okay. That won't kill me. It took the turret. That was slightly disappointing. Just a harmless flower. Although, because they took the turret, it opens us up to take theirs because they're going to want to focus their attention on another lane. Come closer. Just drop it like it's hot. Just drop it like it's hot. Flower. Drop it like it's hot. Come on, hurry up. There we go. And a one, and a two, and a three. So much more to see. Volley. Run, 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 run. Oh. Wow, that was a good ash arrow. Come and we close. traded two for one there. And Ash took that turret. Nice. So, Tristana has the most, rid uh, the ridiculous, the easiest thing. Oh, crap. No? Okay, so we're good. Okay. Yeah. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. Back, back. There we go. Okay. Uh, uh, Tristana has, like, the, the most ridiculous escape out of anyone in the game. Such a busy like, world. honestly, I can't... I, I can't get past the fact that, that escape just has such a long range on it. But the downside is, a lot of enemy abilities will stop her from jumping. So, 
if you can get like a, a stun or honor or something like that, or like mid cast, then you know it's it's not that bad. So. And they took the turret. Now, oh, shit. Um, yeah, but if you can get a stun on her or something mid cast, you know it often. Everything I know so far will probably stop it from from happening, except for the Leona Zenith Blade. That's the only ability I know of that will not. Um, My prey thinks it's so. Okay, um, real quick, for the time it takes them to flash, you can shoot out your grasping roots right where you think they're gonna flash, and they will basically flash into your roots, you know, while the ability is still active. So, because Soraka flashed there, she was gonna end up somewhere around the here, and I estimated it was around. I think I ended up. She ended up getting stunned about here, so I end, I estimated that she would flash probably in this area. And I think because this wall is somewhat thick, she had about yeah. half a second of walking space. So I blindly used my grasping roots in a spot that I thought she would be in, and it ended up getting her without without any vision. So. Off the it kind of worked out. Like, why well, we did get the kill, and we traded two for nothing. So, definitely helped. I would say. But, um, just, just something to remember because some an ability like that that does so like it has so much initiation potential and disengage potential. I need help. I'm out of mana. Oh, good. Okay, it's time to start boarding our jungle now because I don't want them coming in from the side. We don't see them, and then it's just a pain. So let's just safely ward everything. There we go. So much more to see. But yeah, sorry. This this snare has so much disengage and in initiation potential. It's unbelievable, and and I don't even I can't even think of a reason why you would level it first on any in any case. I'm not that fed, but I'm gonna go for another gold item and marbles. Things aren't always what they seem. So hang on guys, wait for me. Just wave clear. So I don't want the turret uh, going down anytime soon. Okay, now this Morgana's flipping shield is gonna be a problem. Oh my god, it's so bad. Like I I can't Everything we do on her is going to get completely destroyed unless we pump out enough magic damage to actually just overpower the, the shield itself, which I can see happening. It's not uh, unthinkable, but it's just it's too too much sometimes. Let's try and get this thing. Got to push because York's pushing top. They would just burn the shield, only with ability power, like abilities. We gotta take this turret because York is gonna take it. Oh, come on! And York's gonna take that tower too. Hey guys, this tower up here.
So that wasn't worth it, because they ended up getting two turrets, three turrets, because that one was not up. God. And we didn't even kill this one. This one is like a few auto attacks away. Okay, now this is a perfect opportunity. Push, mid, and bot. Because we have a bunch of them dead. You know, and if if they put a lot of uh, focus on mid, I can probably get top going. Because they, they didn't take anything that valuable on top. So we, have, we have a window here. You know, and the more minions I can keep, the easier it will be. Because if they send someone like Sirak up, or Zack, their wave clear isn't that great. It gets better after a certain period of time. So I'm going to wear this real quick just in case. Like, it gets better after they use a bunch of their abilities. Um, not, you know, they don't have great auto attack wave clear. So we can just get this one tower down. Crap. Oh, and they saved the turret. Are you kidding me? Don't turn, Kha'Zix, don't turn! Oh, wow, okay. Thought they would go after him, but they didn't. See, oh my god. This is like the biggest problem in the world right now. We're not capitalizing on... Oh my god, or not. My team is not capitalizing on our victories. Like, we have a Tristana pushing the bot lane, split pushing, and they can tear us apart by themselves. They don't need her. And I don't know what this Kha'Zix is doing. So right now it's a turret lead for them, six to three, as well as a three kill um, lead. And at th this point, we need to start warding our jungle, which I can do by myself because I don't need anyone to do that for me. But this is the point in the game where vision means everything. I'm just gonna pull one more by Baron. One more by Baron, so we can keep an eye on it. But you absolutely need vision Wait until in our jungle right route. now. And all these ward spots I'm covering are like the most crucial areas that you need to have vision at. So, oh, no, 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 we're not grouped up, we're not grouped up, we're not grouped up. Oh, engage. Okay, you know what? If you can kill Sorak. Um, come on. Oh, crap. So much Shit! Uh. See, we're n we were not grouped up there. So, for anyone to engage, 
was a bad idea. For me to do that was a bad idea. I really shouldn't have done that. You know? Because they got dragon and now they're going to get... They got three kills out of us. We're not organized at all. Stay grouped. We're not, we were not organized at all. We were not prepared. And you know what? I, looking back, I should have picked up more health for instead of that cage's lucky pick. Because that's, that's doing nothing. Absolutely nothing. It's better for you, for you to stay alive than it is for you to do damage as support. Now, if, if we can magically get an ace on the team real quick, then we'll have an opportunity here to end up moving. What we can do is we can just uh, rush their base right after. Okay, so we were lucky we didn't. Nobody died from that. We got two, and we got two heavy hitters. So we need to push. And there's still this fight's still going on. So we got Soraka as well. We gotta push. We have to push though. If we don't push, we're going to lose. Because now they have. Two of our turrets. Oh, that was a bad move. They have two more turrets, plus an inhibitor. And our bottom is going to be pushing like crazy. Oh, God. We, just, we don't want a kill, we just want towers, guys. Um, placing a ward right there, too, at the bottom of the stairs, is right out of the turret range, and they can't kill it unless they have a vision. Such a busy world. So. not be by yourself. Nobody should be by themselves right now. Okay, all my vision wards have worn, or all my sight wards have worn off. Well, that was a disappointing one. We didn't, as a team, we didn't focus enough. You know, we didn't have someone on someone else. Our top lane ended up losing um, pretty, not early, but pretty hard. You know, York got pretty fed pretty early. And as York, it's hard to fight against him. If you're using a champion that re that uses health as a resource, I didn't actually slip that much. That's all right. That's not bad. This Ash, though, only 150 farm compared to 220 off Tristana. Not very ideal. Soraka, 14 farm, but doesn't matter. She's support. And she went for a locket. 
Kha'Zix went pure damage. And he's, uh, he's mid, sorry. Volibear went health and didn't even think about picking up a locket. I don't know. I could have gone better. That could have gone better. I'll do one more and we'll see. We'll go from there. Oh. If 